I think we can all agree that there are very few iconic viral videos that have really aged that well over the last decade or even perhaps even in the last few uh, years on the internet. This is the honey badger. You see a badger, run away. It's gonna, it's gonna f*** you up. One video in particular that really stands out to me that I gotta say this video makes my lungs bleed every time I watch it. My god, it's so f***ing funny. The honey badger has been referred to by the Guinness Book of World Records as the most fearless animal in all of the animal kingdom. It really doesn't give a shit. This uh, video is the known as the honey badger video. The honey badger video has gained over millions and millions of views in the last uh, in the last decade. Um, today, I just want to tell you the story of the man, the legend that created this beautiful viral piece of content for the internet. And I also want to share with you all of what happened after this video went viral. So, in this video, um, this this video features like a redubbed narrative comedic commentary over pre-existing National Geographic footage of a honey badger. Just living its life, hunting cobras and um, and bees. If you guys like this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell, or even dislike this video. I'm open to constructive criticism. So what's that? What's that? Antoine Dotson uh, quote? Uh, you know, uh, <laughs> you better you better hide your kids, hide your wives, hide your husbands, cause them badges. But yeah, I guess the gentleman's name that came up with this idea, he goes by the name of Randall. And it was later found out that his actual name is actually Christopher Gordon. But I guess that Randall is his, uh, his pen name. I found out that he actually made this video basically like he, he had the motivation to make this video uh, due to watching a National Geographic video of the honey badger. And he just thought that, man, this... How can I how can I make this video more entertaining? He did just that. I mean, <laughs> I love how he adds his twist of like c comedy, and he actually knows like legit shit about this this animal. So I think that that's 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 hilarious. So he like provides like entertainment and also education through this video. Now after this video took off, Randall he definitely struck the iron while it was hot. He monetized on like t-shirts with the honey badger on it. Um, I think mugs with the honey badger on it. I'm sure probably bedspreads, all sorts of shit. Maybe even shoes, hats. I mean, you name it, he probably did it. But he also uh, sold a plush toy, which I thought was kind of funny. Uh, the plush toy. You can actually find his commercial on the plush toy on the plush toy on his own YouTube channel. He also went on to make a mobile uh, game for the Apple and Android, which. Uh, I actually looked into it, no longer exists, which kind of sucks. I was hoping that I could install it on my phone and be able to play it, but unfortunately that was short-lived. So I think uh, maybe he sold a few thousand to a hundred thousand, you know, while the iron was hot and it just, uh, yeah, didn't sell that well after, after, after that, or maybe it just didn't age that well. I'm not sure, but he also went on to doing commercials as well on TV. He also went on to develop a TV show with uh, 611 Media titled Honey Badger U. It was supposed to be a mixture of live action and animation, but the show never really materialized, so that never actually went anywhere, sadly. I mean, he, he really struck the iron while it was hot. And references to this video have appeared in a lot of uh, big name shows like American Pickers, Hot in Cleveland, Glee, and uh, I guess uh, Randall got lucky enough that a frozen yogurt chain, Red Mango, even uh, offered him a deal to uh, name one of their flavors as Honey Badger, which I thought was kind of funny. The video has also been listed as a favorite by big names like Taylor Swift and Olivia Wilde. Also later on, uh, Randall, he ended up making a book on the Honey Badger. And I, I don't think it really, um, and I could be wrong, I, I don't think it sold that well just because it didn't have his comedic narrative. I mean, there's no way to do that with a book, maybe an audio book, but I don't know if he actually made an audio book. I think it was just a physical book. I'll have to look into that. Um, and I'll have to update you guys if you did make an audio book on that. But, but yeah, not not too much is really well known about Randall. Um, I mean, this guy kind of keeps a very quiet life outside of 
all the shit that he did after producing this video. I guess this uh, Randall guy is in some type of uh, legal suit um, over uh, trademark infringement. I saw this video on MSNBC where I guess uh, Christopher Gordon, a.k.a. Randall, and also his, uh, his, def his attorney were actually being interviewed about uh, this trademark infringement suit that they're actually involved in. I guess he's filing legal action towards uh, for trademark infringement. These two uh, card companies were trying to use some of the catchphrases that I guess that Christopher Gordon apparently he trademarked in this video um, on their on their greeting cards. So they're in a legal suit right now, and I'm not sure. I tried looking everywhere. I tried scouring all over the internet to see who actually won the suit, but I guess it's too early to say. I guess it's still in progress. So. I would assume that maybe after all this uh, COVID nonsense, um, I'm assuming, you know, once uh, this virus starts to clear away and they go back to court, you know, I'm, I'm pretty sure, you know, once they do go back to court, um, some more information will pop up on the internet probably later that, at some point this year, I'm hoping. So we can find out a little bit more as far as to who won and who lost and I guess what the uh, the outcome was. So he also he's also made a couple of other videos that have actually gone, you know, semi viral. Looks like he made one about some like sea monster. I'm also seeing here he made like a like a the wild the wild swimming penis fish. I wonder what that what the fuck that's all about. Okay, so I might actually turn this off. <laughs> oh my gosh. That concludes our video of the honey badger dude. But yeah, hey, if you guys like this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and uh, ring that notification bell. And uh, you know, like this video or even no, you know, if you don't if you don't like this video, you you think it's uh, a piece of trash then make sure you dislike this video, and I would totally appreciate it if you send me the, a comment as to, you know, maybe why you dislike this video. I'm open to constructive criticism, and I uh, think that's the only way to grow, so I would totally appreciate it if you guys left me a comment as to what you liked and what you disliked about this video, so... But yeah, um, hope you guys have a good rest of your week, and I just want to say uh, thank you again. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Peace.